Hi, I'm Holly Henry, and this is the Girl Music Project. Don't call me a selfish girl. I know I don't give you the world. You tell me I'm lost in my mind. Can you find me? Let's play hide and seek. Hide and Seek was written about my own personal experience with anxiety and agoraphobia and it's not something that I like to really talk about a lot because I feel like a lot of people are just not too keen to know but you know it's something that I really deeply struggle with and I feel like you know I can't really keep that out of my music. This whole song just sort of portrays that and it also portrays like how it affects like my relationships and how people around me respond to it. We're making it sound very moody and I'm very happy with how it's turning out. You said you'd hold my balls But I hear the cold in your toes My bay My main influences in music are probably artists that have a very specific voice or when you hear them you know it's them, or they have a very specific sort of feel or persona. I really like Lana Del Rey. I like the idea that she's made around her music and how it all kind of ties in together. It all sounds kind of similar, has a similar theme. Um, I like Bon Iver as well. All of his music kind of has the same type of feel to it. Um, and, you know, I like when an artist knows who they are. So in that verse, you go, I try to be um, my own person in my music. I try to make myself seem original and I try to stick to who I am. Just by using the same type of sound, usually, like it's all very acoustic. There are interesting elements to it here and there. They're all quite minor. I just, I found that specific type of music and I really connect with it. I'll conduct you out. Sure. I want just to have that decrescendo uh, into the next section and just stay there for a little longer. I'm always kind of wary of um, working with someone who wants to produce or, um, you know, sort of work on a song that always kind of frightens me because I'm scared that, you know, we won't have the same vision. But I really think that the people involved in this project knew what I wanted and did their best to help shape me personally as an artist and um, the results that I've seen for uh, the video that we shot and um, the song are incredible and beyond anything that I expected. most excited about sharing hide and seek because I don't think I've ever released a song quite like this. This is beautifully produced and so many interesting ideas 
um, both my own and Chris's ideas all combined into this song, I think, or making it um, one of my favorites I've ever uh, released. So I, I think that they'll both find something unique to it, like something they haven't heard from me, and also it'll be, you know, like my original stuff that I've already released, but times 10. The Girl Music Project has been truly incredible and um, the support of so many people online is just very heartwarming. I'm really grateful that I have such a loving group of people following me. You said 